kids welcome to another session of link kids online it is so good to be with you in your homes during the season and today we are going to be carrying on with our new series time treasure and talents we are looking at treasure today what you've got in your hand to offer to god check this out stories of the bible jesus feeds the five thousand this is jesus hey -o who is the Son of God and the Savior of the world. While Jesus was on earth, he taught everyone about God's love. He did many miracles and healed people of their sickness. Oh, hey, everyone. A huge crowd kept following him wherever he went because they saw his miraculous signs as he healed the sick. The crowd started to gather around Jesus. There were 5,000 men and many more women and children. Turning to Philip, he asked, Hey, Philip! Where can we buy bread to feed all these people? You see, Jesus was testing Philip, for he already knew what he was going to do. Um. Philip replied, Even if we worked for months, we wouldn't have enough money to feed them. Yeah, I got an idea. Then Andrew spoke up. There's a young boy here with five barley loaves and two fish. But what good is that with this huge crowd? Jesus said, tell everyone to sit down. Right, everyone, sit down. Then Jesus took the loaves, gave thanks to God, and gave them to the people. There you go. Afterward, he did the same with the fish, and they all ate as much as they wanted. Want some more? I'm all good, thanks. After everyone was full, Jesus told his disciples, now gather the leftovers so that nothing is wasted. You guy. So they picked up the pieces and filled 12 baskets with scraps left by the people who had eaten from the five barley loaves and two fish. Incredible was that story, Bridge. Jesus took fish and five loaves of bread and multiplied it to feed 5,000 people. Annie, I love that story. It's definitely one of my favorite stories in the Bible. And um, God performed such an incredible miracle that day. And the best part about it was he used the little boy in the story, just like he can use you in your everyday life. All he wants you to do is bring what you have, the little things in your hand. And that day it was just the boy's lunch that he brought to the table. And he used it and multiplied it and made an incredible miracle with it. God wants us to bring our best to the table every day. And that might be the talents that you have, that might be sharing your lunch with a friend at school, that might be whatever it is. Whatever you have in your hand, God wants you to give it up to Him. Listen up and lean in as we go into a time of worship now. And don't forget to stay tuned and check out our craft at the end of the video. Bye, Bye guys! guys.